Today is 2nd October 2023. My name is Subhan and it's our ELLT preparation class. So as you know that in ELLT speaking module, we have four parts. The first one is introduction, second one is presentation, third one is essay, and the last one is picture description. So we will start from the introduction. Can you tell me your full name? My name is Sadia Javed. Okay, Sadia. Do you have any nickname? No, sir. I didn't have a. I don't have a, any nickname. Uh, um, my family call me Sadia. Okay, that's fine. Where are you from? I am from Bahawalnagar. It is uh, situated in uh, southern Punjab. It's also uh, the area of Chaudhuristan. It's famous for shrines because a lot of saints buried here. Um, it's also uh, uh, famous for mangoes and uh, oranges. Oranges also. All right, that's fine. Uh, well, what do you do? I am a teacher by profession. Okay, so being a teacher, what are your responsibilities? Being a teacher, I have a lot of responsibility. Is, but um, the big, biggest responsibility is to deliver the knowledge to the students very well. Uh, then I uh, also uh, have a, a responsibility according to the children, uh, to the students. Uh, I should cooperate in each and everything uh, because uh, children are, uh, or students um, are like uh, uh, the son and daughters for a teacher. Uh, they, uh, the teacher should also understand their psycho, uh, psychology and uh, according to the psychology they uh, he, he or she uh, he or she should also teach them all right that's fine okay which course you have selected to study in uk i have selected masters administration uh, for uk study okay and business what, administration okay what will be the duration of this course the duration of my course is one year. Okay. And uh, which university you have selected? I have selected uh, University West of Scotland for uh, my higher studies. All right. And what is the reason that you choose this specific university? <clears throat> there are multiple reasons. Uh, that's why I have selected this University West of Scotland. Uh, it has a diverse culture. Is it uh, uh, offers a remarkable education system to their students? Uh, all the teachers also cooperated to their uh, towards the students. It also provide uh, the course content according to my interest. That's why I have selected this university. All right. Uh, <clears throat> what are your future plans? After getting the higher education, I have planned uh, to come back to uh, Pakistan. Then I will uh, start job in renowned University of Pakistan with handsome salary. Uh, it's my dream because I also inspired my teachers uh, who uh, get who had degree uh, from the abroad because uh, when they teach me, so when uh, they had taught me. They also implement their knowledge uh, uh, by uh, on the students. Uh, I allot many things from uh, them. All right. What do you do in your free time? Uh, when I have uh, my spare time, then I uh, read books. Uh, Sometimes I designing the dresses. When I have a spare time, then I uh, do the gardening. Because gardening is also uh, my hobby, and uh, uh, in my garden, I uh, ha I grow uh, a lot of uh, vegetables like pumpkin, uh, uh, lady finger, uh, brinjals, and I have some uh, um, fr uh, fruit plants as uh, uh, guava, oranges, and uh, um, strawberry something, uh, strawberry plants also. All right. Uh, well, why you choose UK as your study for your study or your highest study? Why you choose UK? 
Well, uh, I have uh, several reasons uh, when I have uh, choose the UK for my higher studies because UK offers the best uh, best academic standards in the world. In fact, Oxford and Cambridge University also located in the United Kingdom. UK has high rank uh, in education system in the world. Um, UK distinguish the multiple culture uh, country. It also provides a lot of facilities and opportunities to their students. Uh, UK also offers a remarkable education system in the world. Okay, that's fine. Well, now we will move to the second part of ELLT speaking module, which is presentation. So, as you know, that the duration of your presentation will be three to five minutes. It means that you have to complete your presentation in three to five minutes. In the start, you have to say, now I will begin my presentation. The topic of my presentation is X, Y, Z. And in the end, you have to say thank you for your attention. So start your presentation now. Uh, sir, uh, which topic you have assigned before? Uh, yes, I have sent you different topics so you can. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay, okay. Mm. Uh, I, I will now begin my presentation. Uh, and my presentation topic is about uh, the... Okay, uh, now I will begin my presentation. The title of my presentation is uh, 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 Sports uh, adv Advantages of the Changing with Games. Uh, there are uh, several disadvantages and uh, advantages playing the video games. Um, in very first, uh, one of uh, it also improving the cognitive ability among the children. Uh, video games is used to improve problem solving, critical thinking, decision making, making abilities also. Um, uh, as uh, they require the strategic planning also. Uh, because uh, a lot of uh, uh, many games also uh, create the mental ability uh, to do something uh, very quickly. Uh, very moreover, many video games demand the precise and uh, coordination uh, when the children uh, playing. Uh, they, uh, it also build the motor skills and reactions time in kids. Uh, to also improve the social interaction, multiple player games uh, that provide the chance to um, the children to engage and collaborate with friends. Uh, in, as you have, we have observed many games are nowadays children playing many games online. Uh, uh, when the children playing uh, games online, it also increases the harmony uh, between the are different kind of people. It also focus, focuses on the educational content. As I, I have observed um, uh, uh, some puzzles, puzzle games also increase the ability uh, uh, to solve the mathematical problems also. Uh, uh, it also in, increase the uh, English uh, spells and uh, uh, other kind of English uh, skills. Uh, uh, when they join the uh, words and make a uh, uh, join the letters and make a word and then sentences also. Apart from these, uh, it also boost up the uh, uh, creativity imagination. It encourages the creativity and the ima imagination by making the kids design characters, um, build the virtual words, uh, and also engage the storytelling. In art uh, field, uh, a lot of games also um, offered by uh, offered by the different um, uh, different uh, uh, play stores as good. It also enhances the ability to selecting the color combination and uh, children do the uh, uh, painting uh, as uh, according to their choice uh, when they paint the 
something then we can also um, uh, can guess uh, their mental uh, thinking also um, and the very first one is uh, it also uh, uh, helpful in lifestyle also it also increase the risk of um, uh, on the other side when we see the disadvantages of the video games it also increase the obesity blood pressure uh, sometime when um, the uh, children are playing games then they uh, become offensive when they have no progress they feel no pro progress in video game mm. uh, it uh, they also uh, neglect their responsibilities and uh, uh, decrease the uh, academic performance also i think this is not good for the children um moreover online safety uh, also very important for the children um uh, sometime cy uh, cyber bullying uh, also in uh, appro inappropriate content for uh, their age not uh, i think it's not good uh, not appropriate for the children another disadvantage is also uh, time management um i have observed many students uh, keep the book uh, in front of them they also uh, uh, reveal the uh, they also hide the mobile phone in the book then uh, he or she also uh, playing the video game the parents consider that he is studying um, or uh, uh, solving something but uh, he uh, this is the loss of the study Uh, my uh, according to my personal point of view um, this depends on yourself how you how the parents and how you use the positively or negatively the mobile phone or the video games uh, uh, also I, we should manage uh, the uh, each and everything according to uh, the um, time because if you have a good time table then you cannot disturb anything it can also if if you kill your time by playing the video games then you can uh, lose uh, so many things it can also harmful if uh, harmful uh, for you in short time uh, you should uh, play the uh, video game children should play the video game they also uh, their parents also manage the time according to their study and uh, other um, activities also this is end of my presentation uh, uh, thank you for your uh, attention all right that's fine well uh, now we will move to the third part of ellt speaking module which is essay So my first question is the from which source you have written your essay uh, my essay was about the homeschooling i have a personal uh, so many experiences because as you know my profession is teacher uh, i have written this essay according to my own observation all right it's fine if you provided you more time for your essay so what are the things you will add to your essay sorry uh, okay uh, uh, if i have a more time then i will include some examples as in case uh, kingdom of saudi arabia uh, home schooling are also found everywhere parents do not send their children in early age first they te um, teach their children at uh, home then uh, they send their children uh, at school Now, the other thing is that uh, i will uh, uh, mention also my sister the example at a grade of till the grade of 5 uh, my mother uh, also taught her at uh, home then uh, at the grade 6 uh, she um, uh, go to the school she was uh, uh, good in her studies uh, from all the students she also have a uh, got first position in board uh, in matric class that's why i have consider uh, good and i will also mention this um, i had mentioned also this example when and then i have uh, if i have a uh, uh, much time okay uh, in your essay you have written a word 
that is <clears throat> potential what is the meaning of potential potential uh, means energy to do something uh, capabilities ability okay another question is that uh, what is the meaning of significantly uh, importance importance or important both are coming in the meaning of okay what is the meaning of bullying uh, means uh, some awkward words towards uh, from others okay uh, every child is distinct in inappropriate words also bullying okay. means okay Every child is distinct with varied learning style and trust and capabilities. Explain this sentence. You know, uh, have a special potential or capabilities. Uh, uh, many children uh, learn the things the most. Uh, uh, it will also take the interest uh, also uh, feel um, uh, their self uh, and uh, also uh, uh, ability to do okay the destruction and pressures endemic to traditional school settings such as bullying or peer pressure are significantly reduced what is the meaning of this sentence? Um, it means it means uh, 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 manage the things uh, with uh, out any stress and pressure uh, or the uh, from the traditional uh, schools. As you know, in traditional schools, uh, all the children learn the same curriculum. And they also feel pressure from their uh, from their teachers because teacher or oh, just uh, force them to learn this uh, this subject. But in homeschooling, there is nothing like that. The children uh, also learn according their own interest. That's why in, in, uh, traditional schools in traditional schools they also face the some awkward words or uh, for uh, the teacher also forced them uh, it also reduced in homeschooling system okay families who relocate frequently due to professional commitments are those with children who have specialized needs often find homeschooling particularly beneficial explain this sentence uh, some uh, families have uh, their job uh, they also shift their home after three years or the two years or four years. Then they can e easily teach them, uh, uh, teach them very easily uh, in home uh, schooling system. Uh, so many families have a business. Uh, once they shift in Lahore, then next year they have to shift in Karachi. Then they uh, um, they have not. Uh, they do not send their children at uh, school. Uh, traditional schools they uh, also uh, in favor of uh, homeschooling all right uh, <clears throat> what is the meaning of passionate passionate uh, excited okay what is the meaning of feasibility the meaning of feasibility is easiness Okay. <clears throat> Summarize your essay. The summary of my essay is this essay discusses the advantages of the homeschooling, uh, how it has been uh, become a popular uh, alternative for many parents. It highlights the customization of the curriculum, reduction of uh, distraction, and access to the digital uh, resources uh, as a key benefit. It also mentioned how the school uh, schooling homeschooling 
can be beneficial for families uh, who relocate frequently or have a children with specialized need needs. Overall, the essay includes that while homeschooling may not be suitable for every family and for everyone, its advantage its advantages make it a more appealing choice for many families. All right. Uh, uh, summarize your essay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Now it's time to move to the last part of ELLP speaking module, which is picture description. So let me share a picture on your screen. After that, we will have a discussion over it, right? Okay. Wait for a while. Okay. Sir, uh, you should send the picture on WhatsApp. Yes, I am going to share. Okay, so this is the picture for you today. Okay. You can start now. Okay. Uh, and this picture is look, look like an entrance of a city because there is a huge uh, gate. Uh, is such kind of gates also located uh, when we enter a city or enter in a uh, uh, state. Uh, uh, there is a big gate. It's made of different kind of ceramics. Uh, its color is white, and uh, uh, there are four uh, cars, uh, which uh, one is going uh, near the entrance, and uh, three is parking uh, uh, near the trees. Uh, one uh, uh, color of the car is yellow, and uh, uh, one is gray, and third one is black. While the um, uh, car is uh, going towards the gate, uh, here is a, a tall man standing. Uh, he also uh, have a wheel uh, under his feet. I don't know its uh, exact name, but uh, I will mention it. Um, he wearing the uh, gray uh, joggers. Uh, with white socks. He also wears the light blue sky. 
कलर शर्ट एंड वाइट हाँ शॉर्ट्स और हाफ समथिंग Um, there uh, also a lot of trees. All the trees are green and uh, have a um, uh, dark uh, shadi. Its color. All the trees' color is dark uh, green, and uh, it also a shady trees because their shade uh, also come uh, on the road. The uh, on the road there are a uh, uh, a lot of lines, as you know. Uh, it uh, it also by the. By abiding the rules of traffic, um, the, uh, here is also a, a fence near the um, road. Uh, it's uh, uh, have a, a few part of fences looking in the picture. Um, in, this is the picture uh, which I have explained. All right, it's fine. Okay. Now on the other side of the bed, there are a lot of people. I am seeing there also a fountain. Uh, he also um, oh, the fountain also running, and people also uh, sitting near the fountain. Okay. Which country is your dream country to visit? I have a dream to visit uh, the UK because uh, UK has the real meaning, you know, the real meaning of democracy. It provides the freedom of expression to their people. Uh, the other thing is that a diverse culture also found, found in the UK. Uh, all the uh, people also um, can live freely there. That's why I have a dream to visit the UK. Okay, uh, and do you like to travel with your friends or family? I would like to travel with my family because fam my family is very close to me. Uh, um, I will enjoy with my family uh, because uh, my sisters and my brothers uh, and uh, my parents also uh, um, cheer with me. And I also feel enjoy with uh, them. All right, that's fine. So this was all about your ear and speaking with your dad.